I've been wanting to take this away since I started working here, to be honest. And I was procrastinating all the time because I thought it was painful. These are just like it's not important enough. But I guess it's not painful and it takes only a second. Let me do this. Hold on a second. All right, so we cleaned her up pretty nicely here. And now what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna give her a little bit of a numbing injection, okay? Small pinch, one, two, three. Make sure she's nice and numb all the way around. How are you doing over here, okay? Mm -hmm. What we're gonna do is we're just gonna do a little shave. Slowly remove this. It's actually just a nice little thick piece here. And she's probably had this her whole life, right? Mm hmm. Just gonna grab the rest of it here. And if we can't really, really reach in here, then we can just kind of burn off those little pieces so it will just be a little more aggressive. But I think even if we get it nice and flat, she'll be pretty happy in here. Now what we're going to do is we're just going to create uh, artificial, well, like an artificial scalp. We're basically burning the top layer so that it stops bleeding. And she's going to have a little bit of a, um, let me increase the settings here. Can I work out today? I don't usually recommend to work out after the procedure the same day. I would probably skip a day. Okay. Maybe 24 to 48 hours. I also don't recommend to take a bath. Okay with this type of thing it's kind of like when you get a boo-boo right and then your body forms a scab you don't not take a shower or not jump into the bathtub um, so what you can do is maybe just throw a little Vaseline on it mm -hmm. so that way you know clean it off throw a little Vaseline on it and then that way it's it's kind of nice and sealed from from the water just because it's kind of an tucked in area um, you don't want to have so you see a nice little scab in here and that's gonna go through the natural healing process, so the wound healing process. So your skin is gonna inch in and make the scab a little bit smaller. It's gonna also grow some you know, new cells underneath and as the wound closes from the sides and from the bottom, the scab will just simply fall off just like a regular wound. Oh, nice. So you can kinda of just go back to normal. Oh my God, this is so weird. Do you understand? I literally had it all my life. All my life. That's why I got the earring too, because I didn't know what to do with it.